Hey everybody, <laughs> it's Tino from peaceloveandpitbulls.org and this is my sweet shorty and this is Bandito. It is June 11, 2017. Uh, for those of you who have been keeping up on the story or those of you who don't, um, this is Shorty. On March 14th, 2015, Shorty was diagnosed with lymphoma, cancer. Here's the date, it might be backwards. June 14th, I mean March 14th, 2015. Here's the uh, diagnosis, lymphoma. And it's two years later and she's still here. The vet said two years ago that she would be gone in eight weeks. It's two years and my love is still here. Um, after the vet saw her, we went on the anniversary, on the anniversary, March 14th, exactly. The vet said, it's a miracle. The longest I've seen a dog survive on chemotherapy was a year. We did no chemotherapy. We did only the Dog Cancer Survival Guide and cannabis oil. I highly recommend that you download the Dog Cancer Survival Guide by Damien Dressler and you get your loved one, human or pup, on cannabis oil. The vet said, it's a miracle. And I said, no, it's not a miracle. It's a plant that has been demonized by Big Brother and makes it ridiculously hard and difficult for us to get a plant to our animal. And I was just online the other day and someone was like, it's not legal here. And I was like, well, it wasn't legal here when we did this either. But if getting a plant to my loved one is wrong, I don't want to be right. And my dog is alive. She is living proof that this works. We did no chemo. We did the dog cancer survival guide and cannabis oil. And by the way, we did a little bit of prednisone, but we weaned her off it about two months in to uh, the cannabis oil. And so this is what it looks like, what we did. We did tinctures throughout the day to keep the, you know, SEAL Team 6 in the system fighting the enemy and FICO, full extract cannabis oil in the syringe. So what, it, what we did was throughout the day, we give the tinctures, which is a little bit of THC and CBD fighting throughout the day. And then at night we hit them with the Moab, mother of all bombs, which is the FICO full extract cannabis oil, uh, CBD and THC. Sometimes it's in the same syringe, sometimes it's separate, depending on your case. Don't go off of what we're doing. Call and make sure that it looks something like this. So I have a company, a guy named Jesse, uh, who I dealt with two years ago, uh, is the guy who helped me get this, save my girl. So the company is called, that I went with, is called OC Consultants, and I will post the number in the description, you don't have to go with them, but make sure that wherever you go, they are lab tested and they have, this is high quality stuff. Um, they are lab tested, they're really uh, fairly priced and they have great customer service. And uh, they, another thing is, is ask where the medicine is coming from. Is it coming from the shake or is it coming from the flower? This is coming from the flower. You don't want the shake, which is the trimmings. You want the best part of the flower, and that's what this is. So, again, I'll post that number in the uh, uh, the description. OC Consultants, his name is Jesse. If you have any questions, call him. You can contact me at peaceloveandpipples.org on the contact page, but I would say don't waste time with me. Call Jesse direct. Time is of the essence. You have to get your loved ones on this as soon as possible. Uh, there's so many ailments that this addresses, but my dog is here two years later. She's here and she's not miserable and she's eating and she's playing and she's swimming. We, we beat this, you guys. I wanna shout it from the rooftop. I want everyone to know that there is help. There is a solution in the form of a plant. And just, you know, share this, pay it forward. Um, Call Jesse from OC Consultants, um, or if you're going somewhere else, that's fine. But uh, just make sure that it's getting they're getting it from the flower, and it is cannabis and not hemp. I can't stress that enough. So I hope this finds you well, and peace, love, and pit bulls. Let me get a kiss to go. Show you, give me a kiss. She just loves to kiss, doesn't she? Mm, she loves to kiss. Hmm. Not baby girl. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs>